All right, Scouts 311 back with Nino Kuni. And we're here in Yule real quick to drop off that familiar that we had to level to 40, which we just did in the last uh, boss fight, or I think it was the first of the two. It just happened. So we're here to talk to our old little girl here who wants him to be strong enough to be able to live on his own. So he's 40, he's in my party. That should be enough to do this. Looks like we need to do a little bit of spirit medium. I should have a keep them, right? Of course. You better, he's loving them up that far. Snowblower gem, 1500 guildas. Five stamps. Who? what is this? Oh, nice. Formulas. Well, what do we get? Do we get the last one? Yeah, the jumbo planet drop. Okay. That should be the last one. Just gonna give us the one. We didn't have that one. We don't really have a lot of planet familiars. Is the actually I didn't even pay attention if he is a planet familiar. No, he's not. But now we can bring our one guy in here for good. And actually, I want to take a look real quick at some of these gems. Like Snowblower is one we got just now, which is a pretty good. Um, one of the higher water ones, I believe. I don't know how to do these. We might have to go to the Temple of Trial or whatever, maybe to do that. We have to go to do those? Who am I talking to? Myself. So wait, how the hell do you use these things then? Well, allows a familiar to learn the heat rate trick. I can't select it. I could switch it. And I can sort. Oh! from here most likely that would make sense there we go all right so this this is our water guy so let's try um like snowblower i don't know if he learned snowblower on his own no i got to see what i want to do yeah he does not learn that trick snowball i think that's the one attack then there's a snowstorm, which does everybody. So let's just try the snowblower. It doesn't arc. So we gotta get rid of one of these. Oh, actually, we don't. He's not full yet. There we go. So we learned a new skill. You go, boy. Heat ray. I don't know what that does, but that sounds pretty good. We'll stick with him on this only for now, though. Just teaching someone somebody. Teaching him something new. Um. Where's the tricks? Let's put it in. So that's the fan. It's basically an upgrade of bubble bath. It's the same thing. It's a fan attack. So kind of just taking that and upgrading. It's not. It's a skill that he won't learn. Okay. So now that we're done with that little side quest, let's head to the Miasma Marshes. And we're on our way to Castle Nevermore. So you can go in the marshes, I guess. And there is a warp point right there. Convenient. We don't have to run through the whole place again. Alright. So here we go. I'm pretty nervous. So the recommended level for this, for Nevermore, is 50. We are pretty high above that recommendation. But I did do a lot of grinding here or there.
so mean. Okay, let's do a quick save before, even though we just started this vid. We are starting into this place, so. Alright. So there's a whopping 12 chests. I believe 12 chests in here. Which is by far the most of any area we've been to. And there's none out here, is there? No, they've been sneaky? No. Defeat Shadar, the Dark Jinn. Oh, it's time. It's time to go after this guy here. Pretty cool looking place, as you'd expect. Undead, makes sense. Nice. First fight, already got somebody. Mumbo Zumbo, baby. Not really sure what he is or what he does, but I like that we got him. Now these bone guys should be resistant to physical attacks, because we got our own skeleton who is. That's their thing. Um, probably weak to fire. I don't really want to do too much spells early on. But... Oh, they're not weak to fire, technically, but it did do some pretty good damage. This little guy does some surprisingly good melee damage. What basically, being say? a mage. It's a gift. Hubbles. It does kind of suck because you get you're able to make her weapon. She has a new weapon, you know, but it's really not worth using it if you're trying to collect guys, which you're pretty much always going to be doing, I would assume. I mean, it's a lot stronger, I guess, when you're right before a boss fight. If you know a boss fight's coming, switch it up. But when I run around the world fighting, I'm not going to try to. What's that? That's the way we gotta go. When I'm running around the world fighting, I'm not gonna try to, uh... I'm gonna try to collect everybody I can, you know? What is this? Oh, it opens up the stairs? Oh, one of the stairs. Okay. Interesting. So anyway, yeah, so I'm gonna be fighting like, you know, I want to collect these guys, so. Okay. So we gotta go that way, looks like, to get the next thing. So if I go this way, most likely be it. Alright, we got a red chest here. Phoenix Breath, good stuff. So, yeah, okay, so it's creating the stairs, looks like, because there's nothing there in this one. I didn't really pay attention to the first one before we got there that there were no stairs. Yeah, there we go. Let's make it up. Okay. I reckon. Didn't you see the cutscene, Drippy? Just in case I miss one, even though I don't think it's really... I don't think we could have missed one, yeah. Just look, a door, you know, man, I'd be able to come back. Just want to take one quick look around. That looks like it's staying open, but just in case. 
Battle of Sprite Dew. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Seriously? Okay. I'm seriously like, seriously, seriously. Whatever that means. A little tripped out here. Holy shit, that's fucked up. Oh my god, that's fucked up. Oh, this Shadar guy, he knows... He knows how to throw a party. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh man, oh, I'm all backwards. Dragonlands, nice. I don't know what that is, but I like dragons and I like lances. Oh, looks like there's a green chest here, too. What? How am I supposed to get a... Oh, wait. I think I saw it. Did I just see... No, I saw that. Oh, my God. I can't do this. I physically can't do it. What do I gotta stand for this thing? I don't think we stand over here. It looks like, I mean, it don't look like I've been kind of everywhere around there. Oh, Jesus Christ. I feel completely wasted. Oh, before I go any farther, let's check out that spear. We got. Let's use the spear. A lance possessed those who wield it, and assume and then remain fiercely focused on the enemy at all times. I don't know what that means exactly, but I do know that it ups his attack and his magic. So that's what I care about. Please stop making me get out dizzy. So I don't get sick. Oh, there's a chest over there. Uh, let's go this way first. There's a chest over here. Shield of the Pure. Man, there's some good. There's some good items already in here. A shield has been cleansed of all evil. It cannot be held by those with impure intentions. Well, you know Rocco has no impure intentions. Rocco has been the stalwart of this group since day one. He is the ultimate professional. So we got two chests over here. Griffin's teeth. Okay, what are those? God, I got so much crack up. That's gotta be an accessory. Ten attack. Fang. That's kind of made for this guy. His magic attack goes down, but that doesn't really matter because it doesn't even use. I don't use magic with him really. He just might come in, do some damage, man, cat, or whatever. Okay. There's that green chest. I'm guessing we hit it from over here or something because it was too too messed up in that other side. Nostrum's good stuff. That's peels. Yes, we do. Nice. Ready? That's pure healing right there. Borlord's armor. God, we got some good items. Uh, definitely get the items in this place. Not that you weren't going to do it anyway. He's only got we have Enigma armor is pretty good stuff. 73 minus 33. 79 minus 35. Imposing and impressively tough. I 
don't like this because pretty much all the stuff we're getting is really worth getting for us right now. It's definitely helping us out. Okay. There's a green chest. Over here. Oh, probably below us. Or above us. Either way, we can't get it from right next to it, probably have to shoot. Obviously we have to shoot it, so maybe across the room or something. What's down here? Nothing. That's interesting. So the green chest is there. So it's gotta be, where is it at? It's gotta be up top, okay, there it is. So it's gotta be a spot right across here. There we go, there we go. Giant's axe. Nice, who gets that? He gets an axe. The only one that can get well, I think he could probably equip it. I think hammer or axe is the option here. 95 minus god, that knocks his accuracy down though. I like having him with this, which doesn't lower his accuracy because I want him to be able to hit. God, it's a lot, it's almost worth it, but not probably. I don't know, I really don't like not having him be able to hit. So we'll go with this guy. He does melee, like I said a little while ago actually, you'd be surprised how much that little mage guy can freaking hit people, or how hard he can hit them. But he does have some nice weapons, those axes hit hard, but they lack, you know, they lack the accuracy, so, gotta make that call. Alright, so where are we at, why did everything disappear? Oh! Alright, took it some damage. Starting to take a little bit of damage here. All be gone. The good. Okay. So there's nothing up here, huh? It's interesting. It's freaky looking, that's for sure. Alright, Swain got to 60. So officially... Everybody's at least a 60, main character-wise. Actually, I need to... yeah. I guess. What does this do for us? There we go. What would I do without you, Drippy? It's not like new sets of stairs haven't come up two times already. Where you going, buddy? Where you going? Where you going? I don't think I'm gonna catch him. No. It's all right. Spring lock. Radiant blade. That sounds really freaking good. Let's hope that that has a light thing to it. Oh, it restores HP when it damages the name. That's not bad. Don't get me wrong. Great Sage's Secret. And another one of these crystals. The Palantir. Palantir. 
maybe. Okay. That's from the one okay, that's the one room where we went in a circle with the green chest. So what were the other stairs that unlocked? Or are there stairs that we like just do we just use stairs that I didn't pay attention? Yeah, there are these stairs, dumbass. How was I supposed to know? We have gone. I've seen them. I'm almost out of freaking mana with uh, Esther. I've been starting almost everybody in here. Not everybody, but a lot of them are weak to light. So I've been starting a lot of these fights out with the light twinkle light spell for my healer. Like this would be a perfect one, actually. But we don't have. Actually, she doesn't have enough mana to cast it. So let's throw her a. Uh, Strong coffee just to get her boost a little bit. But yeah, if you have like somebody with an AoE attack, and I have a lot of them right now, I usually start a fight with it like this. These guys are all weak to light. You bring her out, do some major damage, and then you can bring out your big guy and just clean up basically. Clean up duty. Hoping we get a uh, because she's so long, man. I'm hoping we get a some kind of save point soon. We've been in here for a little bit. All right, that was nice. That was a very nice time for her to level up because when you know when you level, you get all your health and mana back. She was out of mana, so very useful level up for us there. Oh, this looks familiar though. Nice, and here's our save. All right. I think I'm actually going to stop here. Because I, you know what's coming up. You know. So I think we're going to do that as a separate vid. Because I have a feeling it might not be more than just one little thing that happens here. So let's stop here and um, we'll continue in the next video. So thanks for watching, everybody. And we'll see you in the next one.